YouTube, Eric DIY here with another great review for you. Today we're going to review the Picoon B9 wireless headphones. First on specifications, the sensitivity is 103 plus or minus 3 decibels. Mic sensitivity, it does have a microphone, is minus 42 plus or minus 3 decibels. The impedance is 32 ohms plus or minus 15%. Frequency response, which is usually the biggest thing with headphones, is 20 to 20 kilohertz. And the receive distance, in other words, the distance that these can work wirelessly are 8 to 10 meters because they are Bluetooth. They have a lot of padding here. This is like a synthetic leather and it's very soft and easy on the ears you got cushioning over the speaker itself uh, over here nice feature to see you can actually put an sd card which they call a tf card but sd card can go in there a micro one to play music right from that or you can go bluetooth and they also include the option of plugging in just with a 1 8 inch stereo cable which they do include the microphone is right one of these little dots right here and it is noise canceling. Also, they have a nice swivel design on the ends here. It's not gonna go too far, but it makes it very comfortable. You got the on off switch right here, volume up and down right there. So that has a lot of features right there and it has a padded top to it too, with the same synthetic leather type feel. So the way that we tested the Picoon B9 wireless headphones is we let Zach have him on vacation, but he's also here right now. He has his Chromebook back there and he connected it to his Chromebook and also other devices. So Zach, overall, how do you like those, bud? Good. Do they have good sound quality? Yeah. Are they comfortable on the ears? Oh yeah. Yeah, really comfortable. Try them on. Yeah, they're comfortable. And as you can see, the padding surrounds his ears and his top of his head. So he actually wore those on the plane and also in the hotel room and everything. And I actually got to try them out too myself. So to pair, the first thing we're gonna do is turn on the headphones. And we're just gonna hold down the power button on the side. And I'll have an auditory power on, but also have the lights. Really, really catchy lights, but we're really liking the light show there. And the next thing we're gonna do is gonna go to the Chromebook and we're gonna pair it up. So we're gonna go to Bluetooth settings. And he'll search for B9, which is right there on the screen. And I'll click on it and it's finding the device. And then yeah, it's hooked up. It's that easy. Zach's really been on a kick with fire alarms lately. So the headphones really help us so that we don't have to hear alarms all day long when he wants to watch them on YouTube. There we go. He's got a video with a chicken. It's a video with a chicken, everybody. Hey, Zach, can you hear me? You can't hear me? What? So you can see that the headphones really keep the sound in up to your ears because he couldn't even hear me. So overall, it's a pretty nice wireless headphone. That's Bluetooth. It also worked on the plane that way. I mean, you couldn't hear anything that he was watching. So nice job, Zach. So this thing also records sound. It has a microphone on the bottom of it right over here near the USB. So you put it on and we'll do a recording the Picoon B9 microphone. Testing, one, two, three. Testing, one, two, three. We're gonna play that in the internal speaker now. This was the microphone input on the B9. Testing, one, two, three. Testing, one, two, three. So it's definitely passable on the microphone for the headphones. Not something I'd use for audio recording, but it will definitely do for gaming. All right, we're gonna do a little audio test here. We have a SM58, a standard vocal mic, really good quality, and the Picoon B9 headphones. We're just gonna put the microphone up there. I got some copyright free music playing from YouTube, and we'll see how it records. Here we go. And that is our review of the Picoon B9 wireless headphones, Bluetooth all the way. They sound pretty good, honestly. The audio quality is really good. I'd say the pros are definitely that it has no noise leaking out of the headphones. The audio quality is really good, being Bluetooth and all. Uh, connects to multiple options, such as PC. I've had it hooked up to my computer, Zach's Chromebook, stuff like that. The only thing I would say is a con is the microphone. If it was a better, decent quality microphone, it would be 
better, but you know, it, it's it's a standard microphone, so there's really nothing wrong with it. It'll still do excellent for gaming, and it does a nice job. If you'd like to purchase the Piku and B9 wireless headphone, please look for a link in the description below. We'll send you to Amazon where you can purchase your very own. Every purchase will help support the Eric DIY channel. We appreciate all your support. If you like this video and you want to see more like it, please give us a thumbs up and push that subscribe button below. While you're down there, also push on the bell notification icon so that way you'll be notified of all future Eric DIY video releases. We appreciate everything you do for us. Thank you and have a great day. As always, if you like this video, found it useful, please subscribe. And if you have a product that you would like reviewed, please contact Eric by emailing him at eric5150diy at gmail.com. Have a great day.